And now today, space fans have somewhere new to go. That's right, the Kennedy Space Center Visitor Complex finally reopening and perfect timing too, just before that historic Dragon crew launch this weekend. New six While many were disappointed with Wednesday's launch scrub, that disappointment has turned to excitement with a visit to Kennedy Space Center. But as you can see, there are many changes as the Visitor Complex reopens for the first time in months. We're really excited. Um, we happen to really love science. Holly McMillan's family was the first through the gates this morning. That means they also were the first to experience new safety precautions like temperature checks and masks. They're now required for all employees and guests. It's a little hot, um, but we're fine. And I appreciate everybody being really careful so that we can come and still learn things. The measures following guidance from the CDC. That includes attendance capped at 50% with time tickets purchased in advance. Once inside, there are markings for travel flow, hand sanitizer, stations and signage for social distancing. We have barricades where we needed to make sure folks uh, monitor social distancing as well as those uh, floor graphics and, and areas. But while many exhibits are open, others like theaters, bus tours, playgrounds and simulators remain closed. With limited offerings, the visitors complex has reduced ticket prices to $30, something that also includes a ticket to return in 2021. The hope is that things will be fully reopened much sooner. And the return tickets, hopefully that they want to come back when we're fully operational. So they get a little bit of a taste of what we have here. Now, when it comes to watching a rocket launch, viewing closer to the launch pad is still closed. But officials say if you just happen to be here when a rocket launch happens, you're more than welcome to watch. Tickets to the visitor complex for Saturday are already sold out. For now, reporting in Brevard County, Mark Lehman getting results. News 6.